Hey, Dick the Diver, back with another TG5 tutorial. Today we're going to talk about how to service the camera, seals, and the O-ring in the housing for a more pleasurable and better diving, picture taking experience. Okay, let's um, Let's assume either this is your first time to do this, you got it out of the box, or you just came back from a dive and you're going to go again. Um, I personally, every time I open the camera, I do this. Okay, so we're going to unlock this. This is the lock that won't let this turn at all. Unlock that. Pull up on that. Turn that. It's hard to do, but you want it to be hard. You turn this and the case will pop open. There's a little thing in there that makes it come open on its own. So you don't have to pry it open. Okay, just grab the camera out of there like that. So let's just set this aside for just a second. We'll look at the camera first. Now, there's some things we're going to need. Uh, there's some O-ring grease that comes in a tube uh, that you can use. I just am using some that I have had on a little pill container for a while. Uh, you're going to need something to clean the lens with. Uh, you're going to need um, maybe a lens cleaning deal and you're going to need another battery. Okay, so let's do the camera first. Lots of smudges on here. Make sure that's off. Now in here is there's a double lock okay flip this one up first and there's a little there's a color that shows up there and I flip this one over and then this tension will pop it up so you don't have to pry it open either and here is the battery there's a latch for it right here and that pops out too okay then right here is the card. So we're going to take that out and go put our pictures in the computer. And I'm going to put that back in there because we're not doing that right now. Okay, then we'll put a new battery back in here and you kind of get it started like this and it just pushes straight down like that. Now, this is the seal right here. And it's not an O-ring seal, but it's kind of the same. So I just run my finger around it, and then I take a tiny bit of O-ring grease, just kind of enough to make my finger shiny. And I just run around that right there like that. Then if you can, go in here a little bit. Oops. Okay. This is good. Now, if you're using the housing, this is maybe not necessary, but if the housing were to flood for some reason, then this would be your backup and protect your camera. Now, I have to, oh, there's, a, there's a place right here. I have to hold that down, and then I can lock it right there. Over here, there's another one. Got to unlock it there. You can see the same color shows up. Open that up. Now this is how you get in to either charge it or access the pictures through a cable that's supplied. Again, a little bit of tiny bit of O-ring grease on our fingers and go around that and then a little bit in here make sure it's clean. We're not really putting anything on in there. Just make sure it's clean. Hardly ever open this, so but I do check it each time. Again, this little tab right here to hold it down because there's some tension on it. Use your fingernail, push that back, push that to lock it. Okay. We take our lens cleaner, and these are not expensive. You can get them on eBay or someplace like that. Make sure the glass is clean in this. Now that's all I use this one for. for. Um, on the 
back I'll use a uh, lens, lens cleaning cloth you get these with your uh, cell phone there was also one of these included in the case okay so this is ready to go back in the housing so let's call this video and the next one we'll pick up on how to service the housing so I have just serviced the TG5 camera to get it ready to make sure that I put a new battery in it. I took the card out, took the pictures off of it, put it back, serviced the seal in here and here, cleaned the lens in the back. It's ready to go, fresh. So that's what we need to do. Diver Dick out.